Hi folks, back again, Bathroom Chronicles number 138, and yes, I'm on the road. Uh, notice I now have a uh, bathroom. This is supplied by the uh, folks uh, who rent the cabins here. Anyway, I've mentioned before, uh, uh, the cabins are in the mountains of Virginia. It's a great place up here. Anyway. If you've watched more than a couple of these, uh, my two favorite things to talk about are chiropractors and energy healing. Yes, the old energy healing. This one was a slightly different twist. And this is uh, Nancy Clark, PhD. And this is from her website. Uh, it says here, she is a medical intuitive and international lecturer and workshop facilitator on a variety of subjects. She is a certified neuro-linguistic programmer and hypnotherapist. Her doctorate is in philosophy. Uh, and it goes on and on, as they normally do. She authored several books published in several languages, of course, not, not just English. Uh, video, audio, cassettes. In 1991, Nancy spontaneously began to see inside the body. <laughs> Parenthesis. At that time, she had never heard of the term medical intuitive. Within two months, she had begun working with many people who initially wanted a session. Within a short period of time, clients were asking her uh, to teach them how to do whatever it is she's doing. It says here she currently works with several university professors and medical doctors in various countries, appearing on television and radio as well as public appearances. In addition to speaking at many universities and colleges, she has given talks at the United Nations in New York. <sighs> Dr. Clark has private counseling practice with energy healing sessions, whether in person or long distance. The goal of each visit is to discover disruptions in the body energy fields and balance them. She has found that it is also important to discover and reprogram the cause of the problem. One session can save the client years of therapy. Okay, just a little more of this. Anyway, this page, it's from her, uh, it's talking about pain. And an ever-present reality for many people is the physical pain in their lives. It can be due to arthritis, cancer, digestive problems, and the list goes on. The first thing the energy worker needs to realize is that all pain is a result of stuck energy. Do you hear that? Stuck energy. The body is sending a message that something is not right and needs to have attention paid to that area. And then it goes on and on. And then it says, the day I began seeing inside the body, I had no training in healing, but I knew I could not let my visitor leave until I at least tried to change the darkness I saw in his stomach area. Not knowing any modality, my favorite word, modality, I began to move my hand back and forth over the dark area. I saw a golden laser-like beams flowing out of my fingers and into the stomach. Almost immediately, light transformed the area and it looked better than the surrounding area. When the area was filled with light, I knew the treatment was complete. Well, this is pretty normal, pretty routine, actually. Uh, you notice these folks all are working with medical doctors, and they're all working with universities. This one even uh, spoke, supposedly, before United Nations. Of course, it doesn't list any of the universities, nor does it list any of the doctors. Now, my question, there's several questions here. Number one, it's all baloney, but that's neither here nor there. If this woman could actually do this, uh, it would be surely easy to test. Oftentimes people who are doing these kinds of things say, oh gosh, this is so special, we can't test it. You know, there's just no way to test this. It's such a special kind of deal. Well, that's not true. And in this case, it would be real easy to test. She basically says she can see inside your body. Uh, that would be real simple to test. And also, what about Randy's million bucks? I mean, come on. Uh, you know, I know this lady flies all over the world and have conferences everywhere and meets with universities and doctors and so on and so forth, but surely she could stand a million bucks. And the publicity, of course, wouldn't hurt her either. So my question is, Ms. 
a doctor, I'd love to know what that PhD is in. Uh, Dr. Clark, why don't you go down and get the million bucks from Randy? It's there for the taking. Uh, not only would you be a million dollar uh, richer, uh, but you could also have a lot of notoriety. So that's what I suggest. Anyway, folks, and yeah, this is just sort of an ordinary one, but I thought you might get a kick out of a person who could see inside your body and send, what was it, golden rays or something? Oh, wait right a minute. Uh, golden laser-like beams flowing out of my fingers into the stomach. Now that's a pretty good one. I haven't heard that one before. But anyway, as Pat Mandel would say, peace, ladies and gentlemen, peace.